Hey guys, hope you're having a great day. It was a great life. It was a great life. Andy and I both have our emotional support waters. But they hit simple minds. These two simple minds are ready to hear some simple minds. Accurate, alive and kicking. We hit, don't you, parentheticals, forget about me. But I feel like that's not proper justice because like, that's just like the song. We got to hit yeah. some more sauce from that. Uh, and gotta, apparently this is the next one to hit. So yeah, same record too. Dude, let's get into it.
really cool production. Like the, it felt yeah. like a wall of sound in every sense of the word. Like all the elements were just it was so it was cleanly done. Like there was nothing that stood out in a bad way. It was just so much. Mm. Very eighties. Interesting. I had that experience, but not in an overwhelming fashion. Mm. Okay. Thought it was cool. Yeah, I thought it was all cool. Did, did its thing. Yeah, it was just. I think it was a lot for me. That's fair. I think I liked the concept. Like it felt very uplifting, which felt kind of like you too. Me up. A little bit. Think so? Like in the vocals. Mm. Vocally yeah, I can see that. I like can see that. Like Bono a little bit. Um, do that. Which is a great compliment because Bono's a great singer. But yeah, dope. The drum sounded cool. I loved the little production elements. The, I loved how rocky it got. Like it wasn't just the uh, bass was carrying yes. for me a little bit. Also, the guitar when it was digging mm. in it was like nah 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 nah, and then it was having some drum fills that went along with it. That, I mean, it felt like a rock song. It felt like you had an actual rock band, and then you just put '80s production elements on top of it, which I'm a fan of. I mm-hmm. like that. Like I like when you have both like the energy and the clean of the eight, like the energy of like a rock band in a garage, mm-hmm. and then the like polished to perfection production of the '80s. Yeah, I could definitely see that. Yeah, no, it was really cool. I don't... Uh, I'm going to these lyrics a little bit. Out. Yeah, let's go through that. Interesting. I like the lyrics way more written down than I did song. Mm. Yeah, I, I was hearing them when the song was happening, and I was like, these are some pretty cool lyrics. Like, I, heard, I like the uplifting nature of it a bunch. I don't think I got the full message until you read them, mm-hmm. but yeah, the idea of just like, this isn't always going to be good times. Mm-hmm. What are you going to do when it becomes not so good times? Yeah. You should stay around until love comes back and is mm-hmm. alive and kicking. Yeah, I especially like the lyric, um, like, what are you going to do when the love burns down? Like, even just that lyric. I think, like, that, good lyric. I, heard, I heard that one. That one is what hit me. I was like, mm, it's interesting. a good question. It's like, are you going to give up or are we going to try and build this thing back up and figure it out? Yeah, because in love, like in any type of relationship with love involved, romantic or platonic, it's not always going to be the best time. You're not always going to feel as happy and fulfilled as you do mm-hmm. on like the best day as you do some other random day yeah so it's like flows for sure yeah so it's like are you gonna let the flow the ebbs dictate the overall flow mm-hmm. no yeah. cool i like it cool concept love. rating okay three two one b, b plus. plus no way <laughs> dude i thought you were gonna go a i was i was feeling a and i think for a lot of people it probably is like a yeah. or a plus for them I don't know. Because I like the song in general, Mm -hmm. right? But there was some air of like, will I replay this? Probably not. And I don't really have a pinpoint reason as to why. Because it it feels authentic. The lyrics Mm -hmm. feel very deep and poetic. Mm -hmm. The musicality is good. I think think it might just be that wall of sound. Like it might actually just be a little too much for me to connect with it Mm. because of how much is going on. Yeah, I could definitely see that. Which is just a me thing probably. Like I can definitely see this being somebody's like mm. one of their favorite songs. Yeah, especially like back when it came out and you're yeah. dating somebody, had hard times, and, yeah. you're, and you're trying to uplift the relationship and stuff. Or you're having hard times. Mm. And you're like, is this worth it for me? Like, I don't know, maybe. Like, should I stay and see if we can rediscover the spark? Just until the love is alive and kicking. I don't know, mm. maybe. No, it's cool. Really, really cool. I dig. Let us know what you guys thought when it came out. Let us know what you think now and if we should hit more Simple Minds. See you next video. Peace. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you want to get a good time watching that video, go on and upvote the video. Subscribe if you're not already. Check out some other videos here on the YouTube or on the Patreon if you want extra juicy stuff you can't get on YouTube.